lovelies i hope you're all well so cricket have once again released the theme for this week's craft along and the theme is babies so anything christmasy for babies or something for Christmas for babies so we're going to do our inspiration video today we've got a few ideas so the first one is we're going to do a frame so I know someone that is having a little one uh, due quite soon and they're having a little girl and the bedroom is decorated with dinosaurs so I thought we would do a nice frame so that it can go in her bedroom and of course she's due around Christmas so it could be a Christmas present as well so I've got the size of my frame here in my square and I'm going to cut that out in some glitter card just to use it as a nice backdrop my image I got from a design bundle set and I will link to that in the description below I've just bought that in as a print and cut and then I've got my text as well so I am is alphalicious and so is some and raw is the skinny so I've got that completely how I want it so I can then go to make it as always I'm using my maker today but of course if you've got an air and you've got a special material you're using just turn your custom dial or just turn your dial to custom that will work too for my printable vinyl I'm using the Cricut printable vinyl if you don't know how to print, you don't know how to play with the print settings, you don't know how to do a print and cut, you can find that tutorial on the channel. <laughs> inspiration I'm going to make some baubles I've got two different types of baubles I've got round bulbous baubles and then I've got round flat baubles these are both eight centimeters in diameter I've got this beautiful reindeer set from design bundles I will link to it below I absolutely love these reindeers 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 they are super cute this is the one I'm going to use for one of the baubles so I just want to ungroup it and I just want to make a few amendments so I'm just going to hide that for the minute and I'm going to hide the antlers and I'm going to hide the inside ears I'm just going to highlight my bow and I'm just going to weld it just so that it cuts exactly as it is I could attach it but I think for the purposes of today I'm just going to weld I want to hide that and that I'm then going to weld the eyebrows together eyebrows eyelashes what is wrong with my speech today so I want it to be about six centimeters so I'm just going to come up to my settings and I'm going to choose settings and I'm going to change my units to centimeter my width is my highest value so I'm just going to change that to 6 and press enter and of course it will keep it all in proportion for me the other side of my bauble I want it to be text so I'm going to go grab some text there we go so I'm happy with those I just want I think I'm going to use a different color red so I just want to change the red on that one maybe to a pink just so they do cut separately because I'm going to use different vinyl we can then go to make it to do our 
scarf vest or romper. I don't know what you call them. It's a baby, baby grow. That's it. We're going to do a baby grow. Gosh, my brain today. Uh, so we are going to be using iron-on. I'm going to be using a lot of the Cricut iron-on, especially in glitter, because you can see um, that they're not, although it's layered, they're not on top of each other. So we can use glitter. And of course, because we are using iron-on, we want to come through and we want to make sure that we mirror all of our layers. So I've got my Cricut Glitter Iron on here. I've got my two sample packs and then I've got a red and a green. I've got some brown glitter iron on from Crafty Cutter and a kind of muted rose gold iron on from Crafty Cutter as well. As always with iron on, we're going to place it shiny side down onto our mat. 